Find the equation of the line perpendicular to x minus 3y equals 9, passing through negative 1 half comma 2. We begin by finding the slope of the given line. We can do that by solving for y and determining slope-intercept form. Here we'll subtract x on both sides. That'll leave us with negative 3y equals negative x plus 9. To isolate y here, we could divide both sides by its coefficient, negative 3, leaving us with y equals 1 third x minus 3. So here we have slope-intercept form. From slope-intercept form, you can read the slope directly from the equation here. The given slope is 1 third. Now the question asked us to find the equation of the line perpendicular to this given line. So if the given line has a slope of 1 third, then the equation of the line perpendicular will have a slope that is opposite reciprocal. The opposite reciprocal of 1 third is negative 3. We'll use this and the point to find the equation of the line. In this case, the point that's given through which the equation has to pass is negative 1 half comma 2. And the slope we've determined is negative 3. We'll substitute these values into point slope form. In this case, we have y minus y1, or y minus 2 equals m, we found is negative 3, times x minus x1, which is negative 1 half. Simplifying, y minus 2 equals negative 3 times x plus 1 half. Distributing negative 3, y minus 2 equals negative 3x minus 3 halves. And then finally, adding 2 on both sides, we'll have y equals negative 3x minus 3 halves plus 2. Now we need to add negative 3 halves and 2. That requires a common denominator. We can think of 2 as 2 over 1 and multiply numerator and denominator by 2. And that'll leave us with negative 3x minus 3 halves plus 4 halves. Negative 3 halves plus 4 halves is 1 half. And so the equation of the line perpendicular to the given line passing through negative 1 half 2 is y equals negative 3x plus 1 half.